Next question is, are ghosts real? And what are they? The question is whether more and more people are capable of seeing the effects, in other words, in the, shall we call it for simplicity, the astral planes, that is, shall we say, in the descent of consciousness through its condensations, ideas appear and actions appear in more and more solidified forms. So the field, shall we call it, above the physical is the remnants of old actions. And if one is to focus upon it, one will begin to perceive. Let me give a more physical explanation. If you go to the shopping centre, and you see, shall we say, a young child on its tricycle. It is motoring across in front of you. You can watch it move forward. Or you can adjust your viewpoint so you can see it doing that as a whole as if shall we say the thread of time has stood still is that an illusion or is it the ghosts of time does this make some sort of sense? Mm. You understand that there is mm, a ghosted image of time mm, left inside. Mm. So mm, what are ghosts but mm, the ghosted images mm, of time? Mm. Okay. So mm, are they real in the sense, mm, is it occurring in the present? Mm. Or are they simply mm, mm, the residual mm, 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 concepts left mm, as an image mm. in time? So it's the potentially the resonance of something that happened. So if, say, somebody saw a ghost in the garden that doesn't necessarily mean there's a spirit in the garden. It's more they are tuning into the resonance of that shape of that person of, of that course. had happened previous times. Of so course. it's like time um, overlapping. Of course. Mm. If one goes to a site, shall we say, of a dreadful occurrence, one can see, shall we say, the images that are left in the frame in the field, as it were. Why are these images left there? Because of the emotional impact mm. that set them in time. Is there an emotional resonance too? That of course. Is that, is that our emotional reaction of the images? I want to say in the descent into physicality, the emotional framework is what is leaves in the astral field. So it is always how one is attracted, how one applies one's concept, if you like, one's desires into the world. So 
everyone wants a certain thing, even if it is resistance to a certain thing. Mm -hmm. It has just as much emotional impact mm -hmm. to bring that into being. Are you talking about the focus an individual might have on a particular place or an energy and either whether they're trying to tune in and focus or they have resistance of something either way? Shall we say in the terms of the ghost image, mm. one, of course, has to be open to it. Otherwise, the physicality and one's own emotional intent mm. overrides. One sees the physical world as one is projecting it. Okay. But if one is open, then often one sees the, res the res residual images left in that position. Always, of course, to the degree of the attachment to that place. Okay. So if one is not highly energized, one will not see all the rest of the images. So some, if somebody moves into a house, for example, and there's a lot of residual images and resonance of emotions, is there a way... I know that there are people that do offer services, but is there a way that we can clear that those imageries and residual emotions? When one acknowledges something, that it is, shall we say, real in the sense mm. of where it is, then one would naturally mm, communicate. One mm, would speak mm, to the image. Mm, one would mm, acknowledge mm, the particular experience mm, and mm, suggest that unless they are willing to release that, mm, they will be uh, trapped in that place for a long time. The images will be trapped in that place or the- Of course. And, the, and of course, the energy leak that is tying the soul up, the consciousness is trapped. Oh. Better to say, the consciousness is trapped in the image in okay. other words, in the event of which they have not processed the lesson. So they still are tied to the event and they've not been able to fully move on. Of course, and then they are energizing it. They are feeding it into existence. How else? Can it stay there? It is not a permanent thing without energy. Everything requires energy to manifest it okay. at whatever level that is. So the, it's not just images or the resonance of, of, of the emo, residual emotion. There is a consciousness still tied up. Of course. Okay. Mm, of Fueling course it, it and the energy. Mm, mm. Of course. But they haven't been able to. So, if the consciousness has moved on from the physicality, have they not then been able to do their review and um, move on into consciousness? Are they still tied? Shall we say the review is held up, of course, okay. because the residual concept is still there in their consciousness. For example, there are many hotels, if you like, mm. that are filled with alcoholics. Yes. They are yet to release that nature 
and one more drink is all that is required in their mind. So they attempt to attach to others in their and consciousness form. So they're basically trying to attach to those that are under the influence of a of the same addiction that they had of in course. physical life. Yeah. Of course. And so it feeds both ways. Yes. Mm? So mm, both are energized. And mm, of course, that mm, is less helpful mm, mm. to the mm, one who is mm, still in physicality. So the consciousness may not be able to move on for decades or even centuries in our human timeline. Of course, is that? Mm. of course. And that has been the case in many circumstances. And sometimes even talking to such residuals will not free them, they will not be ready or willing mm, to forgive. Mm. So mm, many of these are held back mm, by vengeance. Mm. 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 A willingness to mm, damage others. Mm. And sometimes mm, that certainly occurs if a person is open to that, if yeah. there is an underlying guilt. Okay. So if somebody takes over a premises where there is that residual energy and they are focused on it and they're affected by it, if, to have then a conversation with this residual energy but if that energy or that consciousness is not willing to is it heal is the right word then then what you have to live with it i want to say this such a situation mm, mm, is a rarity. Mm. Okay. In the end, mm, if one was clear, if this were clarified, one mm, would simply mm, move from the mm, situation because mm, it is mm, they are going to mm, continue, mm, mm. but it is rare. It okay. is very rare. Mm. Thank you. And very often these are old places with significant events having occurred. Mm -hmm.